much longer. I'm going to have to wait for these test results. I know I aced the theoretical. I know I dominated in the practical. So what's taking so long? Uh, sooner I get to class 1A, the better. Uh, don't tell me they're going to throw away my application now after I take the test. That would be very unwise. Isuku! Whoop. Yama! You got a letter from UA! Really? Let me see it. Him, pretty much grounded from Inko, just tearing it open, seeing that there's a letter. W where is it? Just looking at a uh, hollow disk. When you had to base it on the table, he and Inko are met with. Uh, seemingly happy forced smile all might in which Izuku is pissed Inko seeing this she's like oh, I remember when you used to love all might all might sucks oh okay you're like oh boy what were my results well yo Midori you seem to have Aced the theoretical exam, you just dominated in the practical exam. So I am happy to inform you that you have made it into UA. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I knew, I know I would. So I hope you have fun next week when you join the general studies course. <laughs> What? Iko seeing the rage just bubble with Izuku trying to calm him down. As he's like, You said yourself I dominated, I aced. Come on, why am I not in worry? Well, you see, the reason why you are not in 1A is because you have to earn the right to be there. Don't tell me this is this is uh, because you are quirkless. We wish for you to actually earn your spot at UA. He's class 1A. First, you'll start with general studies, then work your way up to the hero course. First with 1B, then 1A. Either way, your courses will start next week. And. For the other part, click here. When he does, it's power loader. And he's like, You are accepted into the support course. You are one of the best technicians I've ever seen. It, it's beautiful. Like, yeah, finally I get some damn recognition. And goes, Wait, you, you signed up for a support course too? Yeah. Since when are you tech savvy? Well, uh, being gone for so long, you had to pick up a few new tricks. I, for one, had got a knack for technology. Huh. Uh, okay. <sighs> I think I'm gonna go to bed. What? But it's just in the afternoon. I know, but lying awake at night, wondering when you would ever come back, if you would, kind of threw me off my usual sleep schedule. So, uh, good night. Suku just like, damn. If only I didn't take so long to come back. If I only finished that scene more hunt beforehand. <sighs> Maybe one of the biggest bad for her. Is he gets a notification on his gauntlet. Elder? What the hell was he, he calling me for? I had bring the hollow image. Elder is Tondim's. Okay. It's Zika. 
Here's the thing. We got a mission that we need you to complete. Hmm? What kind of mission? We heard tell of some bad bloods out in the area. Just came out in an asteroid field somewhere. We'd like you to check it out. Really? Yeah. Remember what we told you about bad bloods? Yeah, they're ruthless. They don't care about a fair fight. Yada yada yada. Seriously, but deep down the yowja, what? I'm sure they would at least, you know, honor something. <sighs> Listen, Izuku. Though, yes, they are yowja, they are yowja who broke our code of honor. We do not know all their crimes, but let's just say they skipped out on bail. They didn't take their punishment like Scarface did. That's right. Scarface would have tried to run or succeed in running. He would have been labeled a bad blood, yes. Which was which would uh, did make it easier for him to regain the honor, the, uh, honor that he lost. Huh. Alright. So, give me the coordinates and I'll... Oh, wait, another thing. We just received some news on some upgrades that we've uh, established. For uh, weapons, armor, something that makes your ship faster. Continue. You know how it took you five months or so to get back home. Yeah. Now it'll be more like two weeks, give or take. <coughs> you serious? Yeah. Okay, when can I ex expect these, uh... Well, actually, they should be right near your scout ship. We jettisoned them pretty quickly. They would really want to hear and test out your new equipment. You're the best, Elder. Oh, <laughs> please, please. I I don't uh, need such praise. But you can keep praising me if you want. Isuku just rolling his eyes with a smirk on his face and just tells Zinko he's going to be gone for a little while. Her trusting Izuku just hasn't promised that he'll make it back. Him? Don't worry, Mom. I'm sure. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, wait. Damn, I'm going up against bad bloods. That... Shit, I need to be prepared. I need to make sure my plasma casters are, are fully clean and functional. My wrist gauntlets. Huh. If anything, God knows what could happen. Huh. As he heads out to his scout ship, it being strategically placed and cloaked, so no one should be able to at least detect it or see where it is. And lucky for Izuku, yeah, no one's noticed. <laughs> when he gets back to his mothership, he does want to make this trip as quickly as possible so he obviously hurries up with his new upgrades making sure that they're fully functional before he goes on his little bad blood hunt Ugh. seriously why did they add to break the code like that uh, another time another place Maybe we could have been friends. As he jets off. When he gets there, he says, What the hell? This... Holy shit. Well, he sees a huge ass asteroid with lights around it in a certain area. Like, what is that, Docking Bay? 
no, no. Hold on. I'm gonna need home. Uh, uh, elder, see, see if I'm in the right place. He tries and tries and tries. No dice. Okay, I guess I am in the right place. <laughs> Seriously. I didn't see no asteroid field, but there's one huge ass asteroid in the middle of this place. Hmm. Wait. As he takes a look at his computer and scan the place, and he does pick up at least 10 moving inhabitants. One just staying still for an unusually a large amount of time. But then something else happens. A distress beacon starts blaring and messing up with systems, forcing him to actually have to dock. When he onboards his ship, he makes it so no one can use it except him. As he checks. Okay. Then five Yao just show up. Right right then and there, as soon as he sees them, he's already got a bad vibe. As he's looking at their armor, it's littered with Yao just skulls. Uh, so who are you? And why are you wearing our armor, boy? Um, <clears throat> my name is Suzuki Midori. I am answering your distress call. Really? Huh. My, what interesting armor you have. <laughs> the better to display our trophies. <laughs> really? It sure something not because you're bad bloods. As they all pull out their plasma catchers aimed straight at Izuku. Him just... Listen. You don't want to do this. Oh no, I think we do. Hmm. Alright. How about this? Either you surrender and get on my ship so I can take you to Yaja Prime where you can face judgment. Okay? Or I slaughter you and take back any willing survivors of my onslaught. <laughs> Are you serious? Oh, yes, very serious. As they get a better look at his armor, he's. <coughs> uh, Elder. What is it? This guy, he's part of Dark Blades. What? Him getting a better look is... No, 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 no. What the hell? Why, what were they thinking bringing in a human? Fuck. Uh, what should we do? How we jammed all the signal, so... Chances are, they won't, no one will know. Hey, 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 hey! What's with all the whispering? Maybe we should just talk in our usual. As they start clicking and all that shit, Izuku's like, I can still understand your asses. <clears throat> Say what? Yeah, I speak fluent, Yaoja. Uh, um, well, <clears throat> Elder, what should we do? Tell you what, young man, yeah. I'll make you a deal. A fight. Me, you, whoever wins gets to choose what happens next. Fight you to death? Is there any other kind? Is Izuku, he puts all his gear on the ship, only having his gauntlet and his wrist blades. The Yauda Elder, the same thing. As the others just crowd around him. Just wondering. Okay. All we gotta do is wait. And see how this goes. 
as Izuku and this elder Yaoja start to slur go all around each other. Making sure that whoever makes the next move is toast after they miss. As they go ham on each other, but well, Izuku slashes at this motherfucker's chest. Yeah. He's surprisingly fast for his build. Yes, he's taller, bulkier than Izuku, but he's surprisingly fast. Where Izuku does actually nick him, it's not enough to kill him. <laughs> in fact, he is pissed as all hell that Izuku even got a good hit in at all. But this is when he grabs Izuku, slams him to the ground, grabs him by his skull and slowly starts crushing Suku yelling on pain until he starts laughing. <laughs> oh, what's so funny, you ugly son of a. <laughs> Zuku, with his wrist blades, tries but misses in cutting the elder's throat and cuts off his dreadlocks. Blood spewing from each and every one he cuts, which he cut eight of. Tells them to fire. Izuku, surrounded, has no choice but to jump as high as he can, hoping that he doesn't get blasted on. He does. In the calf. It hurting like all oh, hell. Like shit. With your honor. We're bad bloods. Honor went out the window as soon as we ran from our judgment. <sighs> Kill him. As this clan leader just walks off, knowing. So, well, thank you for the equipment. As Izuku, this is when he starts filling with his gauntlet, and. Yeah. A smart disc shows up and slices through heads of seven other other Yauja bad blood members. Surprising the, the clan leader as he turns his head and sees, yeah, those Yaojas are dead. They are headless. Zuku just barely being able to get up as he slowly starts to heal over. <sighs> Man, I should have known. What's a bad blood? As he's about to throw a smart disc again. Always a bad blood. But this is when these Yaoja actually do something smart. At least the remaining do. They end up actually throwing a, a EMP bomb. Just you have to bring all Izuku's technology on hand. Except his ship, luckily. He knows he can't take on all these Yaja at once, and they sure as hell ain't gonna fight fair. So he has no choice but to run, leaving a trail of blood behind him as he is still healing. Oh shit, 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 shit! Man, I ain't got no more, more armor. I gotta. I need to find somewhere. I need to. Him going through the vents. <laughs> God damn it. What the fuck is wrong with this thing? Maybe I should add a surge protector or something. Uh, fuck, 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 fuck. As he hears the Yaoja just running to get him. Since, yeah, there were ten of them there, counting the clan of the year, he's killed seven. So there's only three left. Minus the eleventh. No, uh, you could say heartbeat. But still, that one hasn't moved. Suku wondering, oh, don't tell me that's like a final boss match on the video game or something. Him just trying uh, to. Okay. Let's think. What should I do? Wait, what am I saying? I know exactly what to do. Motherfucker, I'm blooded. I'm part of Dark Blade Clan. I've been trained by motherfucking gouges. We are hunters. Now, 
time to get to hunting.